今天我们来谈论鸟类。Today we are going to talk about birds. What is it that makes an animal a bird? What are birds? 鸟的主要特征是羽毛。The main characteristic of a bird is feathers. 鸟有翅膀和中空的骨头。Birds have wings and hollow bones. 鸟下蛋。Birds lay eggs. 鸟是温血脊椎动物。Birds are warm-blooded vertebrates. 鸟是怎么飞的 ？How do birds fly? 飞行的鸟类通过拍打翅膀，并利用空气的压力在翅膀下方产生声力，就像飞机一样。Birds that fly do so by flapping their wings and using air pressure to create lift under their wings, just like aeroplanes do. 中空的骨头也有助于飞行，因为它们有助于使鸟儿轻到足以飞翔。Hollow bones also help in flying because they help make the birds light enough to fly. 虽然飞行是鸟类一个重要的特征，但是并非所有鸟类都会飞行。Although an important characteristic of most birds is flying, not all birds fly. 一些不会飞的鸟类，如企鹅、玉鸵、鸸鹩和鸵鸟。Some birds that don't fly are penguins, kiwis, emus, and ostriches. What is feathers? What are feathers? Feathers are very important to birds because they help them fly, help them fly, and help them fly. Feathers are important to birds. Feathers are important to birds because they keep them warm, help. Then fly and provide camouflage. 羽毛是由角蛋白组成，指甲也是由这种物质组成。Feathers are made from keratin. This is the same stuff that fingernails are made of. 角蛋白是一种非常强而轻的材料。Keratin is a very strong and light material. 羽毛的中心是一个空心轴，称为羽轴。连接到轴的是许多小分支，称为羽枝。At the center of the feather is a hollow shaft called the rachis. Connected to the shaft are lots of thin branches called barbs. 羽枝上还有更小的分支，称为羽小枝。所有这些分支构成了一个可以聚集空气飞行的轻型结构。Of the Bobs are even smaller branches called bobulus. All of these branches make a light structure that can gather air to fly. 世界上有多少种鸟类 ？How many species of birds are there in the world? 今天有大约一万种不同的已知鸟类。There are around ten thousand different known species of birds today. Thank you for watching.